Hi guys! Uh, for today's vlog, it will be just a skincare video. Obviously, you guys can tell by a title. Um, I'm still kind of hunched because I still don't have my tripod with me. So, yeah. If you guys have been watching my, my previous Vlogmas's Vlogmas videos, um, then you all already know about the situation I'm in right now. Um, I thought it would be a little bit more fun if um, I in a way watched the video with you and just explained what I'm doing and stuff because, you know, it's just me, like, scrubbing my face. And the first thing I do when I start, you know, taking off my makeup, I put my hair up in a ponytail and I use the morning burst clean and clear morning burst cleanser um, I love this thing it like the little beads um, make your face well it makes my face feel so fresh in the end like, it makes me feel like okay I cleaned my face like um, and it does take off makeup the reason why I don't use makeup wipes first and then I wash my face is because I feel sometimes I'm, I'm not sure if it's the wipes I'm using or um, or something but like I don't really like rubbing my face with like a makeup remover like with a makeup wipey because I feel like I'm just like like scrubbing scrubbing like my face with a like not a paper but you know like a wipey so I prefer like taking off my face makeup with um I just feel like that's better that's my thing I don't and then what I do afterwards um, I usually do take off my eye makeup with like an eye makeup remover but I recently I just put water and then it started like my, my like my mascara started running and then And then sometimes I don't I don't do this every day, but like I do it like every other day when I exfoliate my face with this, the St. Ives Fresh Skin. Yeah, I do I do recommend you all to, if you do have a skin condition or something to do to first ask a doctor. I do not want to like, you know, harm you guys. I do this every like every other day to get all the dead skin off your face especially if you have dry skin yes I started exfoliating and my foundation as you can tell it's like a little bit better it has been better so dry skin I recommend like you guys to exfoliate it gets you like it gets off all that dead skin off your face reveals smooth skin like it says right here another tip um, or, or another thing that I do not every day but um, I do try to do it like as frequently as I can. At, like what I do when when I don't exfoliate, I use I use the I know what it's called. I forgot. I've searched it up in Google because <laughs> I cannot come up with the name. Um, it's the aloe vera plant, and it is very very extremely helpful if you have dry skin. I love using that on my skin. Um, it's very inexpensive. I cannot explain how much I recommend this to you all. So what I do when I do not exfoliate, I use the plant. Um, and it just like refreshes your skin so much, especially if you have dry skin and you do not drink water. That is a major, major help. After I apply the plant on my face, I do take it off with water. And then um, I dry my face and then I put cream on. I know that I don't show myself like kind of like patting my face between that. But I do dry my face and I kind of let time pass a little bit. And then I apply cream. I do use the Benefit Eye Cream under my eyes. I love Benefit's um, eye cream. I very highly recommend it. I, I believe that's the only thing that's high end in this, in this video. And then lastly, I do put some lip balm, and right there I'm just using the EOS yellow one. And to be honest, I do not like the yellow one. I like the pink one. But I could not find my pink one that day, so I used the yellow one. <laughs> when I dry my face, I really recommend you guys to pat your face. Do not rub. And also, change your bed sheets. 
as frequently as you can. What I do want to say is that I do use face masks as face masks as well. I love peel off masks. I feel like that like really like gets all like oh like the makeup and oil and sweat and dirt and all the nasty stuff off your face. And I I don't really use like high end ones or anything like that. I just use like the ones like from Walmart or like HEB. And every now and then I do use the Sephora ones, but I do like mainly use um, drugstore ones. And the one I'm gonna use today is the Charcoal Mo Modeling Peel Off Mask. So I do recommend you guys if you wear makeup, take off your makeup as soon as you get home, because oh my god. And do not sleep with your makeup with whatever, like, God, like, it doesn't matter if you're, like, super, super tired, take off your makeup, make sure to take off your makeup, make sure to be cleaning your makeup brushes if you do use makeup, um, as, I think it should be very, very often, let's search, let's Google how often you should wash your brushes, this is all about Googling, okay, so it says here, supposedly, for concealer and foundation brushes at least once a week to prevent buildup of product. Brushes that are used around your eyes should be cleaned at least twice a month. I believe that's it. I don't really plan my videos, so I feel like I'm forgetting something. If you guys have any questions, don't be afraid to ask me because I do feel like I'm forgetting something. Um, yeah, if I forget something, I will put it in the description box for you guys. And I will list all the products that I use down in the description box. And that's pretty much it. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. Bye, guys.